As we all know, Barack Obama made history as the nation's first black president when he was elected in 2008. For many African Americans, the achievement held added significance because it was something many thought they'd never witness in their lifetimes. Well, as we celebrate Black History Month, Fox 5's Deidre Duke sat down with one local octogenarian mm -hmm. for his unique perspective on the impact Obama's presidency will have on future generations. I always thought he had a chance. And, and uh, he proved me right, you know, and I was very excited about that. Like many African Americans, Sonny Ward wasn't sure he'd see a black man elected president of the United States during his lifetime. But when President Barack Obama first ran for office in 2007, this self-described optimist thought the young senator from Chicago had a real chance. The president of the United States. To see a black man in my lifetime become president of the United States was quite an event. The Mississippi native attended Jackson State University and was drafted after graduation. Ward moved to Atlanta in the late 60s for a job at Lockheed Martin, you know, then went on to work for General Motors. I was always an admirer of him while he was in office, you know, and, and, his, and his wife and family. Reflecting on Mr. Obama's two terms in office, the 80-year-old especially admired Barack and Michelle Obama's work on behalf of America's children and believes they served as great role models for black youth. There's somebody they can actually see. He looks like me. President Obama and Michelle, and they say, well, I can do that too. Before, they say, oh, as far as I can go where I am right now, and, you know, now we, that layer has been erased, I hope, and we can move on, you know, on up, on up, as far as we want to be. While he believes the country was moving in the right direction under Mr. Obama's leadership, Ward wishes the former president would have done more for the nation's historically black colleges and universities. I'm a product of HBCU, and I'm a strong proponent of HBCUs. And I like what they're doing, and I, I know that they take care of their students, you know. <clears throat> You're not just a number. If he could have helped us financially, we probably could have had more programs, you know. We could have maybe had more engineers or uh, uh, more doctors or something like that, you know. While Ward wishes Mr. Obama could have done more on that front, he believes the former president and the first family helped challenge negative stereotypes blacks face at home and abroad, while paving the way for future generations of African Americans with presidential aspirations. Oh yeah, we have some kids coming up now, very, very, very smart. And I look for them to be president. In Atlanta, Deidre Dukes, Fox 5 News.